Yo, what's up, motorized bicyclists? Today we're back with another video. As you can see, that's not my bike. <laughs> so, I have my buddy's bike over here at my house today because it's having a few problems. I fixed most of the problems, but uh, we're still having chain problems. He still has the stock chain on there, and as you can see, it's a it's pretty loose. That's just because I haven't fixed it yet. I need to tighten it somehow. I don't know. I think I'm just going to wait for the new chain to come because I ordered a new chain for it. And, uh, I don't know. I've been trying to get that thing to stay. It don't want to stay, so we tried to wrap duct tape around it so it was thicker, and it's still just not wanting to stay. Right now, it's working how it is, but that's not the only problem. This chain, one of the links is, like, super wore out. Like, the pin has a, a, a big ring around it like where it's been moving so he didn't want to ride at home and have a break on his way home so he left it here and i got him a ride so um i'm just, i gotta replace the chain on it that's a, about all i have to do i think i already shortened the gas line because we needed to do that i adjusted the throttle because it had a lot of play in it his clutch lever the lock on it the screw came loose and the spring came undone so it uh it wouldn't lock anymore because it was just spun around so i fixed that um it had an intake leak which i still think it does somewhere but i don't know what to do because i replaced this gasket and i re i like took a bar and pried this this way while i was tightening that and that's the smallest i've been able to get that gap so it shouldn't have an air leak but it's acting like it does i really i don't know what to do about that it runs all right. It, it hits top speed, but when it's trying to idle, it just idles all sorts of funky. Um, but that's about all I did. I adjusted the clutch cable too because it was a little loose. Uh, yeah, I think that was it. Oh, I took there was an old speedometer cable that was when this was just a bicycle was on here, but the actual speedometer part was gone. It was just the cable, and then so I took that all off to make it look nicer. Uh, I think that's about it. I, I'm just, I'm waiting for that chain. I ordered him a gold 415 chain, just like my bike. And, uh, it should be way nicer than the one that's on there. So, I'm excited to get this thing fixed to where I don't need to tweak it anymore. Because before his chain started messing up, it had, like, barely any problems. All very minor, mutt minor minimal fucking problems i don't you know what i mean they, they were small things they weren't things that were hard to fix it was all shit that i knew how to fix but the chain is just being a bitch and then you can see my gold chain on my bike that i i had to dilapidate my my black bike which i already wasn't driving it because the rims are all messed up but i had to dilapidate the chain and the tensioner off it the tensioner for one of their bikes and the chain for my bike because i was riding home the other day and my chain just fucking flew out behind me but uh, I'm not exactly mad because it was a stock chain and it lasted me a few months. And now I got this nice gold one on here and I don't even need a tensioner. It, it deleted the, I was able to delete the tensioner with a good amount of tension. So I'm happy uh, with this. The only thing that's wrong with this whole bike is the motor. Everything else is good. It, it's got good tires. The tire went flat the other day and then I, it sealed itself because it was a slime tire. And then I was riding home the same day that Cole's bike messed up, and it started going flat. And it went fully flat in my driveway while I was going to get pieces to fix his. So I had to ride my mini bike back to go get him. <sighs> but I put some fix a flat in it, and it's still holding. It's still got a bunch of air in it, so I don't know. But it's probably going to fucking rip again because that's my luck. So I'm going to end up having to change it. And then my tension on my chain is going to be all fucked up again. But it is what it is. I'll figure it out. I've always figured it out, and I will continue to always figure it out, because that's what I do. <laughs> but, that's my update on my bikes. Um, Mini bike's doing good. That bike's doing good. This bike's not working, because no chain, no tensioner. Motor's good. Front rear tire aren't very good. They both have missing and loose spokes. But, uh, yeah, my friend's bike is down technically i mean te i guess technically it rides i just wrote it down to the lake earlier when i was testing the new intake gasket and uh, when i adjusted where the carburetor was at on the manifold but 
it's not very good. It's not good for riding long distances. So I'm gonna fix it, and we're gonna be able to ride again. But uh, peace out.